Hey guys, Epsa here, and today I'm going to be talking about the Inferno mode game type that was introduced to the game just a couple of days ago. Now, first of all, when you first logged into Destiny on Tuesday during the reset, I expected Inferno mode to be installed to the game immediately. Instead, we're met with this, which we have two blank things, and the, uh, the, the, the Trials of Osiris thing is still not filled in, which is what I thought Inferno mode would be, but I think that's more of a you need the invite tickets or whatever, and that might be in the Inferno mode sometime, or it might be a separate event entirely. But, as far as I know, the, 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 the tickets haven't been introduced. But, aside from that, it wasn't installed into the game during reset, which just boggles my mind as to why the hell that wasn't happening. So, I went, okay, I'll just do the Nightfall. And got killed immediately by a Thrall, and then I was killed uh, by a Shank some time later, because I'm an idiot and was trying to solo by myself. And then I got all the way to Sepix Prime, um, get him down, I think, to half health, and then I'm disconnected. Because um, Bungie decided that they wanted to kick everybody off the server so they can install Inferno Mode. Thanks. Anyway, uh, my experience in Inferno Mode was... Now, I'm not good at control, like, I'm, I'm bad at it. I play Clash, and I'm awesome at Clash, and Rumble, I'm great at. But control, I'm just no good at for, I don't know, reason. I think I'm missing something, like, I know how to, the game type works, I know how to control the zones, and it's just hit or miss with me on this game type, and I'm not sure why. And it's probably because most people go in with a party into these games and actually kick ass. And Inferno Mode seems to require a party. If you go in solo, you have no real communication because even though we have the new um, communication system for our fire team, nobody talks. And that communication is key to winning when you have no radar. And that's so painful. I did not realize, I, I took the radar for granted, I didn't realize how much I used it in the other game types. I still find myself looking up in the corner going, oh, there's nothing there. Um, and it's, it's more difficult than I thought it would be. I like the scoring system. The scoring system is where I think the game should be. I don't think we should be gaining extra points for getting precision damage. That's a cool thing to add into the game, but it shouldn't be in a key game type. I like this very um, toned down point system. I would like assists still to count towards our personal scores, not towards the team scores and perhaps precision kills and things and those extra points counting towards our personal score. But as far as the point, or score or points that go towards our actual team and winning the game should be simplified like this at all times. And that's I think, is really good. Now, what do I think of the game type? Um, I don't like it, unfortunately. I like the point system. I like the change to the radar, but it's just... It fills me with as much rage as Iron Banners does. I get so upset at it, and I think that's because I'm bad at control, and I don't understand why all their um, new game types and things need to start with control. Like Iron Banners, I would like to see Clash Iron Banners or something else. Or um, even Combined Arms, just something more than control, because I really don't like the control game type. It's not my favorite thing. How about Capture the Flag or some other systems, please? Please, Bungie. I mean, it's not that difficult. Um, anyway, uh, yeah, I just got so upset with this game type, and I only played, I think, two or three matches before I finally decided, no, I'm done with this, because I'm just, I, it just made me so upset. And I'm thinking that that's because I was at a major disadvantage because I didn't have my radar. My teammates um, that I randomed with weren't communicating. They would run in one at a time again because they didn't know how to play control, and I was playing against really good players, just awesome players that I'm guessing were on a team together, or knew what the hell they were doing at least. And I'm, ki I'm still average at this game type, and my teammates were just dumb, and I still did horrible. But basically for this game type, you want to either be like a god at control and know what the hell you're doing and have lots and lots of experience in this game type, and you want to have good teammates and teammates you can communicate with because communication is now key to winning. It always has been, but more so because that radar is gone. So go in with some players that you know and people that you know in a fire team and make sure you're communicating and always stay together as a group. That is horribly important. I don't know how many times I've been, I've run past enemies or our entire team will run past enemies and half of us will be dead before we realize that there's a guy behind us. So yeah. What do you guys think of the game type? Please leave your comments down below. I've been Epsi, and I will see you next time.